Hey, it's Nick and welcome to another Fat Guy Review. This week I'm reviewing something called Birchbox. It's a monthly subscription that focuses on like the grooming part of the man and the fat guy too. So skin, hair, beard if you can grow one, which I can't grow one. Like this is three days of me not shaving. Uh, and then the hair I don't do anything to. So honestly, I'm probably the worst guy to be reviewing the Birchbox. But I do have some skin problems that I kind of want to work out. And, you know, it never hurts to be moist and more moisturized. So let's see what they sent me. And then I'm going to fast forward a week and see how it all worked. Uh, Birchbox tip 405. There are different products for your face and for your body. Because face skin and butt skin are different. First thing I get is Method Men Sea and Surf Body Wash. Very manly. Eye cream for the eyes or the under the eyes. Natural face wash. Uh, I didn't know you were supposed to wash your face every day until I got married and she was very shocked when I said I don't. Super hydrating eye cream. What's with all the eye cream? I mean, I get it. I'm old, but I don't need two things of eye cream. And last but not least, Hydra Memory Cream Gel. Double, Double hydration. hydration. Cream gel. So let's fast forward a week and see how I feel about all this stuff. Here I am, in the future. Wow. It's been a weird week here in Oregon. So, everyone's on lockdown. And I'm, uh, I'm moisturizing my face. So, there's that. Here I am uh, a week later, and I'm just bouncing off the walls because we're all stuck in the house. Okay, so I've tried everything in the birch box for a week. So the body wash, it was cool. Like it had like a like that little eucalypt, eucalyptus, eucalypti, Euca, eucalyptus, yeah, type feel uh, where my I felt like I could breathe. But other than that, this is body wash. The hydrating cream or hydro memory cream, yeah, I mean it, it works. I ran out of this one first, um, but like try to keep my face moist. If you do the side by side, uh, nothing's really changed. But again, it's been a week. My wife told me the skin game is the long game. I don't got much time left. That's why I'm playing the skin game. I was a fan of the face wash though. Like it was kind of nice like cleaning my face and it felt all like squeaky clean and this was all soft and foamy. So that was cool. The eye cream I felt weird putting on. The instructions are like uh, stippling motion is how you apply it. No idea. St Could have just looked it up. But no. So I'm assuming stippling is like. So I tapped. Because the wife said tap. So I tapped. And that's annoying. It burned a little bit. Is ice cream, I guess eye cream is supposed to burn a little bit? That's that's not fun. It's right in my eye. But to be fair to Birchbox, I am definitely not the customer they're trying to get to. Like they were pushing beards and hair grooming products and things like that. I don't wear anything in my hair. I don't grow a beard. I don't have a mustache. I don't have body hair. It's really not for me. Although I could use some hand lotion. That would be the thing that you should be pushing right now. Anybody else? Like, yeah, I could have probably put a sound effect there, but you gotta pay for those. I ain't paying this economy, I'm not paying for nothing. If you think this is for you, if you have a beard and you're more manly than me, this might be something you look into because they give you samples. Those are all sample size. And then you can purchase like the full size if you like it. No point in giving you a full size of something you don't like, right? So you try it out. If you like it, you buy the full one. Uh, and then you have all these new products that you're discovering. If you would prefer the beauty box, I'm sure it's the same on that side. I got the uh, grooming box, which just by the name of it says, it's not for me, so I probably won't be getting another one, but at least we got to look at what it is. I didn't know what it was, so now we all know. Ah, knowledge. Ah. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next week with another unboxing. Next week, I'm going to do Bespoke. I've been holding on to it for a week. I'm excited to open it up, uh, so we're going to do that next Sunday. Be safe, wash your hands, use some lotion, and I'll see you next week.